Hey guys, what's going on? Peter Zang here once again. So I'm going to show you today how to get any Autodesk software for free. So it's pretty simple. All you have to do is be a student and not use it for commercial use. Because if you do, well, let's just say that it's illegal. So anything that you print using an AutoCAD that's an educational version will print with a border that says educational version on it. So it's not a big deal, but you won't be able to use it commercial for commercial use. So that's fine. You also have to be a student, of course. So anyway. Go down here, go to Chrome or your favorite browser, and then type in student login Autodesk or some version of that. So that's going to bring up this list, and you're going to want to click on the one that looks exactly like this. So click on that. So mine's already here, so you're, you guys are going to go to Need Autodesk ID, and then you're going to fill out all this information until you have registered. So nope, don't want that. So I'm going to go to login and use my information so then sign in so it's going to bring you a new screen that looks similar to this so if it doesn't bring you to this screen you're going to want to hit free software because this is where all the free software is so if you already know what version you want just go ahead and click on it so okay Revit sure so you just want to follow these instructions pretty much you can check your system requirements I mean most of the time it's fine because you don't need much more than two gigs of RAM I mean it suggests that you have more but it's not completely necessary so whatever your computer is it's, it's most likely fine unless it's really old so select your version 2013 is fine English 2013 and 2014 are so similar it's if you look up specs on it they're they're almost identical operating system windows and then just hit next and follow the rest of the instructions and that's how you get any of your Autodesk software for free thanks for watching